feeling much better. It was pity, of course, not to play in Rome. Um, but yeah, looking forward to start and uh, um, hopefully it's going to be a uh, good result. It was pity from last year to withdraw, but uh, yeah. We've been practicing, uh, nothing new guys, so what to tell you more? <laughs> Yeah, uh, can you uh, speak about your first round against Great Minen? What do you know about her, and how do you see that uh, that matchup? Uh, we played a long time ago uh, against each other, and uh, I mean, uh, I, I feel pretty confident. So uh, I think it's going to be a great match, and uh, I was uh, trying to to play much at a time, so yeah, looking forward to it. What do you know about her game? Uh, what can you tell me? <laughs> well, she's uh, playing a lot of slices and... Sorry? Yeah, she plays a lot of slices and... Uh, and uh, she has a good, uh, good serve also, so... Hello, I'm from Poland, and I want to ask you who is the more difficult opponent for you, uh, Iga Świątek or maybe Arina Sobolenka? I uh, well, I would say Arina. We play a lot of tough matches, and she is very aggressive. She uh, she she has uh, good power, and uh, with Iga, I feel like uh, I have. Uh, uh, more dominant in the just game by by my power over eager, but with Irina is so tougher. <laughs> Hi, Elena. Good to see you. Um, so, a couple disappointments this year for you where you weren't able to defend titles because of illness. I know in Indian Wells it took a little while for you to come back. Was it was it easier this time? And have you been practicing and progressing and feeling healthy for a while now? Of course. Uh, uh, now I'm feeling much better, and uh, it's it's always pity to to miss these big tournaments. But uh, if the health issues are there, then you cannot do anything. How do you feel about your momentum overall when you have to skip these tournaments so you haven't played again since Madrid? Do you still feel like you have rhythm? Do you still feel comfortable about your ability to get to hit the ground running in the first round? And yeah, of course. I played so many matches, and uh, uh, I think I have everything to, to go far in these tournaments. And he asked about Iga. Um, you're two and zero against her on clay, although she did retire from that one match. Does the fact that you're able to compete so well against her on the clay surface give you confidence overall in your clay game? Yeah, of course, it gives me a lot of confidence. And uh, as I always say, I think I improve every year, every every tournament, and uh, of course, this uh, wins against uh, Iga. It gives you confidence. You said you improved a lot uh, on clay also. What has been the biggest improvement in your game on clay? Uh, just, I think, movement, of course, and uh, just overall the, the, the matches I played and, uh, the, of course, strategy and everything.